Hey, we are just a couple of weeks away from the highly anticipated season finales of some of television's hottest shows. The storylines are closely guarded secrets, but Entertainment Weekly columnist Michael Asiello has been doing some digging and he has a few clues about what we can expect. Good morning. Good morning. Let's go through some of these shows. Big Bang Theory, big hit here on CBS. What's the big surprise as the season winds down here? Well, Mayam Bialik, uh, known the world over as Blossom, is guest starring in the finale as a potential love interest for uh, Sheldon, wow. which is interesting because the producers have already said that Sheldon has no interest in women. Right. Uh, his first love is physics. Yes. So this is going to be an interesting dynamic. It's kind of the asexual sort of what is he really right. question. Uh, very interesting. Also on Monday nights, Charlie Sheen, Two and a Half Men. There are all kinds of stories. He's leaving the show. He's not coming back. Is this the is this the end? Of of that show? Is this the end of Charlie Sheen on Two and a Half Men? Well, it could be the end of Charlie Sheen on Two and a Half Men. It's definitely not the end of the show. It's already been renewed for next season. Okay. Um, it could easily come back without him. They could rename it One and a Half Men. Or they man could bring and in, a Half. They or... could bring in another actor to replace him. Um, so it remains to be seen what they're going to do. My hunch is they'll work it out. Okay. You know, they'll come to terms. They on tend the to do work those yeah. things out, don't they? Desperate Housewives. Still around, still yeah. thrilling somebody, right? <laughs> what, what's, what's the big surprise in Desperate Housewives? Well, we know Lynette is pregnant, and it's been a cursed pregnancy, and the delivery will be no different. Um, apparently, literally cursed, or uh, well, it's just it's been a, not, it's, been it's a, not gone well. It's not gone well, oh. and the delivery is going to be just as bad. Apparently, mm -hmm. she's going to get tied into the whole serial strangler storyline, and I have a feeling get kidnapped and then give birth. <laughs> That's that's my hunch from what I'm hearing, but it's not going to be pretty. Oh, that's very funny. Yeah. Uh, Grey's Anatomy still cooking along over there on uh, ABC. What can we expect on that show? All we know is that uh, the producer has promised a game-changing finale in the truest sense of the word. It's a two-hour finale, and last year, let's remember, she killed off George. Right. So she's, you know, she's Something, someone who, who, who backs right. up her, her words with action. Yeah, maybe somebody's favorite star. Potentially. Certainly. Yeah, possible. maybe. Maybe. Yeah. All right, we're not going to let the uh, <laughs> let the cat out of the bag as it were. House. Now, something, things are, it's an interesting show because this, this is a character, main character, mm -hmm. who is sort of fraught with problems. Could they get any worse for him? Well, he's been Vicodin free all season. That's been the oh, big see, arc. That's, I'm, so I'm been he's away been, from the show. He's been struggling with sobriety, mm -hmm. and it's going to be tested uh, pretty much like never before in the finale, and he's going to make that decision. Is he going to fall off the wagon? Is he going to stay on the wagon? Uh, uh, I think we're going to get an answer to that Okay. Question. Also then, NCIS, right here on CBS, spectacularly successful, yes. but a challenge for Mr. Gibbs. Always a challenge for Mr. Gibbs, and, and this time he's going to go to Mexico for a showdown with a drug cartel, blood will be shed, uh, potential lives in danger, and mm -hmm. I'm told there is a top secret ending that is being shot that wasn't in the original script. Mm -hmm. So I think we're going to uh, expect some big twists in the final seconds. All right, L lots of news about American Idol, not the yeah. least of which is Simon not coming back and blah blah blah. Well, d d give me give me some info about uh, American Idol. Well, Simon is definitely not coming back, mm -hmm. and there's a lot of speculation. Is the show going to still be a force to reckon with next right. season? It will be, yeah. you know, because they'll end up bringing in someone, you know, I'm sure high profile, probably someone without an internal sensor like Simon, who just says it as it is. Is Elton John going to replace him? I don't know. I mean, there's talk about Isn't Elton that John. one of the big rumors that's out, the floating around the, out there? One of the rumors, you yeah. know, I think that would be interesting. I, I think you need someone like that to yeah. replace Simon, someone bigger than life. Sure. And someone who's not afraid to tell it as it is. Any chance Paula would come back? I doubt it. I, right. th I think American Idol is, is happy to be rid of her. <laughs> <laughs> now, let's leave it at that. It's a Paula free zone. Yeah. Michael, thank you very much. Do appreciate it, sir. A lot happens early on The Early Show. Weekday mornings on CBS.